lovely people welcome back to our channel it's me Z today's video is all about motivation and how to boost motivation me personally I'm a person that can get super motivated and then when I'm super motivated I can like do loads and loads of stuff I just bang out everything but more often than not I'm just not motivated at all and I can just I'm just a lazy bum really and truthfully and I'm trying to change that I'm really really trying to change that but I thought this video would be perfect absolutely perfect for this like amount of time especially for uni so it's kind of like a uni series video but you can use it for any aspect in life but it's April May June exams are coming up for you guys and you guys might be feeling a bit slouchy it's kind of you get into the end where you're starting to feel a bit just tired you can't be arcs you know i've been there i've been there i've been there i've been there so i thought i'd throw out like five tips just five simple tips that you guys can do just to boost your motivation so that you can do your work so that you can pass and that you can have a great summer but you don't have to think about work until september or if it's your final year then it'll be over so let me get right into it the first tip is to organize yourself it's as simple as that just organize yourself you know you've got loads and loads and loads and loads of things to do but it's the case where because you've got so much to do it's like oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh and you just get overwhelmed if you just write a list of the stuff that you need to do you can see it head on you can then prioritize and be like oh this part one is much more important than that I must do this one first or maybe if I knock off all the easy stuff I can then spend all my time and energy into cracking on with like something that's really really difficult so buy yourself a diary buy yourself like a to-do list book or a notebook sort of thing just make sure when you're when you are doing that you are jotting free time down as well you don't want to like fill up every day full of like work 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 and things that you need to do because you're gonna work yourself out the second tip would be a tidy space i know for myself i can't work i can't do anything if if it's like uh, if i'm in a messy space and it's so terrible because i'm a messy person that's just like what i am so majority of the time my space is messy so therefore i can't work because that's just a sort of mentality that i've brought myself into i can't work if it's a messy space so make sure that you have a tidy room like your work area if there's like a certain place where you do your work your desk or if you do your work on your bed or if you do your work in the kitchen just make sure that area is always tidy so that you've got your space to do work and it's clear you know a clear room a clear mind and all of that jazz if you've got loads of clutter clear it out it's easter holidays you've got that time to do so right now so the third tip it's a bit strange i don't know maybe it's just me maybe it just affects me and i'm just an oddball but i'd say lighting and warmth so the lighting in a room can really affect my mood if i'm in a dim room i just automatically feel tired and lethargic and i just don't really want to do anything like if the light's dim or if it's like a really orangey warm light i just can't do anything it just with me that just signifies my brain to just go into shutdown mood and to sleep and it's the same thing if I'm, see Daisy. it's the same thing like if the room is really really warm like, anyone who like comes into my room anyone who knows me just like they always ask me why is my room so cold it's because when my room is warm my brain just goes into shutdown mood it just thinks that it's sleep time so i always make sure that i have my window open the radiator is always off or the lowest setting possible because <coughs> sorry i'm really ill I, no, I'm just, I don't even feel ill i just feel congested uh, and i just don't understand why because i've got that window open but anyways making me more productive so who cares but yeah back to what i was saying before um so yeah my room is always cold i've got always that fresh air blowing in and keeping like just my brain awake and if my brain's awake then i'm going to feel more motivated to do the work that i do number four is taking care of your body making sure that you have a healthy lifestyle and i don't mean just like oh let's go for a run oh let's eat some spinach oh yeah just any of those stuff just like making sure that you've got a healthy body so that's through fitness and eating the right stuff and making sure that you also you have a healthy mind as well 
because you're getting to a stage of if you're taking exams or you've got like loads of coursework that is due at like the end of the academic year you're going to be stressed out so you want to make sure that your mind's in the right place your body's in the right place so that you can feel good within yourself so that you're able to then do those sort of things and take on those challenges if you catch my drift my fifth and final tip is to just do it be like Nike and just do it guaranteed once you've started something you're gonna want to finish it or try and complete it the best that you can and even if you start something and maybe do 20% of it at least it's 20% more than what you did already and what you would have just not done just so just do it if you know you've got something to do once you've thought of that in your mind do it because it's not gonna get done until you start doing it that's it those are my five tips let me know if that helped let me know what was your favorite tips in the comment section below let me know if you have any sort of other tips that help you to motivate yourself so please just jot it down in the comment section below i would like you to give a thumbs up if you like this video if you want more uni series sorts of videos and I would also like you to subscribe because it's free and it's nice and you know it could be a good deed for today. Just press that subscribe button. You won't you won't you will not be disappointed. I let you know for now. I'll let you know that now, son. But yeah, that's all for today. I will see you in the next one. I hope you had a great day and bye!